Without it being two commitments. So fringes I think are very going to be very big this summer anyways um, in a variety of lengths and shapes and I think that concept behind the individuality of each model or each woman that is going to be walking in Arpita's clothes <laughs> is, uh, is a way of honoring women, is a way of honoring the mood of the, of the collection by Arpita and definitely what we can do with the Dyson tools is create something that works on all hair types. So as a collective, it is about individuality um, and, and, and the freedom to express yourself. Sadly, in India, people don't really follow hair trends very much, you know. Lots of people still want to hold on to the length of their hair without really doing anything else. And I've been saying this for the last 30 years. So a fringe is a big move. <laughs> you know, there was a time um, in India where I would have short hair and everyone I would meet would have long hair. Now times are changing. I do go to parties or events and meet people who have slightly shorter hair, like yourself. Um, and it's great to see that women and men are experimenting with their hair. I don't think there is a very specific fashion statement per se. I think individuality is more about is more the statement of of this century. <laughs> you know, I think earlier. The 60s, the 70s, the 80s, there were very specific looks. And if you were not wearing those, those looks, then you were not in fashion, you know? But now, I think that's changing. And, and thank goodness, it's changing. And people can embrace their individuality. Even when you create a haircut, when I create a haircut for someone, I'm not necessarily looking at what's trendy. I'm looking at what will work for that person that person's face shape, bone structure, the overall body, stru body structure, you know, what is that person's lifestyle, how much time do they have to spend on their hair. It's become more individual and personal, I think. So the deeper shades of all, any of the colors, so like, the reds, the browns, the bronzes, the caramels, the, the coppers, all of them work 
you know, and can work. It depends really where you place the color inside the haircut. So one of the things that have been big for a while is, you know, uh, uh, this sort of the front being lighter and brighter. And I think that that whole trend has given people the confidence to experiment. So it's been fantastic. I've been wearing it for years now and I'm loving that people are taking that idea and doing different different things with it. In terms of color, I think reds always work really well. I think browns work really well and a combination of maybe even blondes, browns, caramels, two, three shades put together in a nice way can sometimes be even more interesting than just one flat shade, you know? I think I'd have to say for personal use, not professional use, the Air App. Because the Air App allows you as an individual to recreate many looks that you might see in, on the ramps, on TV, in fashion, anywhere. It allows you to create that yourself at home. So it's got the hairdryer, it's got the, you know, it's got the smoothening tools, it's got the um, anti, you know, the, the anti flyaways, it's got everything you need in one pack. So I think if I was a consumer, my, uh, the product I would like would be the Dyson Airwrap.